Half a day, everyone. I'm here with Governor Eddie Bazacalvo to talk about an effort to mitigate environmental impacts to our beautiful island. Buenas and half a day, my fellow Guamanians. Now, whether it's joining forces to clean our parks or plant new trees, my administration and the Navy continue our one Guam approach to ensure that future generations of Guamanians are able to enjoy our lush forests and clear blue waters filled with coral. In keeping with our commitment to protect our island's environment, we will conduct an ungulate population control project on Naval Base Guam Ordnance Annex and on Anderson Air Force Base Retidian Point, starting this month and through May. The project includes a study into the foraging habits and population control methods of the invasive animals, specifically feral pigs and deer. Now these ungulates will promote erosion that impacts our coral and are a pest to farmers because they destroy crops. Our village mayors will be working with the Navy to distribute the deer meat. And I encourage you all to contact your mayors for further information. Now, unfortunately, the pig meat cannot be donated to the public due to U.S. Department of Agriculture regulations. Governor, this is a great example of how our local government and the military are working together to protect our island, home, and our one Guam. Absolutely. Now, please remember, for more information, you can call my communications office at 475-9304 or the Joint Region Marianas Public Affairs Officer at 349-4055. Now thank you everyone for your time and attention, and God bless you all.